My name is Orlando Marcano. I'm the Assistant Chief of the New Haven Fire Department. It's O-R-L-A-N-D-O. M-A-R-C-A-N-O. And what did it look like when crews first got here? The call came in at around 512 for a heavy fire showing at 18 Dean Street. Upon arrival, they found heavy fire in the garage area, uh, what was believed to be a vacant home. Uh, nearby neighbors state that the house was just purchased. There's a car in the driveway, but no one was home. There's luggage inside. It appears that the family was about to move in. Unknown what the cause of the fire is at this moment, but with the high winds from the airport and the open area, created a high, uh, huge challenge for the firefighters. So uh, since it was a vacant home, who called 911? How did you guys find out about it? call came in from a resident. The fire was under control within 45 to 50 minutes. Uh, crews doing a great job. Right now they're overhauling, chasing for hot spots, using the thermal imaging cameras and looking for any areas that might still be kindling in the background. Was the garage damaged? The garage is definitely damaged and it extended into the house. How did the airport make things tricky for you? This wind is, is kind of brutal, right? Well, again, having pockets in a home like this with knee walls and, and closets create a challenge. You have to get through a double ceiling on the second floor. There's a ceiling on the second floor plus one in the attic. The wind actually creates a challenge by feeding the fire and creating a higher uh, flames. Do you know where it might have started in the house? It appears to have started at the garage, but until the investigator, the fire marshals do their investigation, we won't know exactly. Anything else? No. Thank you. Thank you so much.